hello everyone in this video we are going to learn about expansions and powers which is a part of number system before going to this chapter let us study laws of exponents there are some laws of exponents so let us study one by one the first law of exponent is x to the power m into x to the power n then we can write it as x to the power m plus n this is the first law of exponents second law of exponent is x to the power m divided by x to the power n is equal to x to the power m minus n this is the second law of exponent where m is greater than n third law of exponent is x to the power m upon x to the power n is equal to 1 upon x to the power m minus n where m is less than n the fourth law of exponent is x to the power m rise to the power n which is equal to x to the power m into n the fifth law of exponent is x to the power minus m can be written as 1 upon x to the power m and minus m comes down what happens x to the power plus m x to the power 0 is equal to 1 this is the sixth law of exponent seventh law x y to the power m can be written as x to the power m into y to the power m eighth law x divided by m to the power n is equal to x to the power m y to the power m this is the next law of exponent here is the one more law of exponent that is x to the power 1 by n can be written as square root of nth root x nth root x these are laws of exponents we should know about these law of exponents that is x to the power m into x to the power m equal to x to the power m plus n x to the power m divided by x to the power n equal to x to the power m minus n where m is greater than n x to the power m divided by x to the power n is equal to 1 upon x to the power m minus n where m is less than n x to the power m raised to the power n is equal to x to the power mn x to the power minus m can be written as 1 upon x to the power m x to the power 0 is equal to 1 x y to the power m is equal to x to the power m into y to the power m x upon y to the power m is equal to x to the power m y to the power n x to the power 1 upon n is equal to nth root x these are the laws of exponents here is the first question based on laws of exponents simplify a to the power 6 into a to the power 8 is equal to how much here i'm going to use one law of exponent that is a to the power m is into a to the power n is equal to a to the power m plus n here instead of m and n he had given 6 and 8 i'm using those numbers a to the power 6 into a to the power 8 is equal to a to the power 6 plus 8 which is equal to a to the power 6 plus 8 is 14 that is the answer similarly i am using the same law to this number also to this problem also x to the power 5 plus minus 3 x to the power 5 plus into minus minus 3 x to the power 5 minus 3 is 2 with the sign also you can say minus 3 also you can say 5 minus 3 x to the power 9 plus 3 minus 6 therefore z to the power 9 plus 3 is 12 minus 6 z to the power 12 minus 6 is 6 these are the answers x square a to the power 14 let's go with the next question a square into b cube into a to the power 5 b square i am rearranging the num variables here a square into a to the power 5 b cube into b square here i am using the law here a to the power 2 plus 5 here because similar base into b to the power 3 plus 2 same base b a to the power 2 plus 5 is 7 and b to the power 3 plus 2 is 5 this is the answer for this question a to the power 7 into b to the power 5 here 5 into 3 i'll write into x to the power 7 into x to the power 4 5 3 is a 15 
x to the power 7 plus 4 that is 15 into x to the power 11 7 plus 4 is 11 this is the answer here we go with the next question p to the power 3 and p to the power 5 i'll write it one time rearranging the terms q to the power 4 into q to the power minus 5 p to the power 3 plus 5 into q to the power 4 minus 5 this is p to the power 3 plus 5 is 8 q to the power 4 minus 5 is minus 1 this p to the power 8 i'll bring this q to the power minus 1 downside what happens q to the power 1 this is the required answer when it goes again it becomes q to the power minus 1 therefore p to the power 8 divided by q to the power 1 is the required answer next question x to the power 7 into y to the power minus 5 here i'll rearrange the terms x to the power 7 into x to the power minus 5 and y to the power minus 5 into y to the power 3 here x to the power 7 minus 5 into y to the power minus 5 plus 3 x to the power 7 minus 5 is 2 into y to the power minus 5 plus 3 is minus 2 and take this y to the power minus 2 downside because it is minus when it bring, comes to the downside it becomes plus x to the power 2 upon y to the power 2 that is x by y whole square that is the answer x to the power minus 2 we know that a to the power 0 is equal to 1 therefore x to the power 0 is also 1 x to the power minus 2 into y to the power 5 into x to the power 0 is 1 into y to the power minus y to the power minus 7 x to the power minus 2 into y to the power 5 minus 7 x to the power minus 2 into y to the power 5 minus 7 is minus 2 I'll take this y x to the power minus 2 downside it becomes 1 upon x square and 1 upon y square it can be written as x square y square this is the required answer we can also write it as 1 upon x y whole square because 1 square is 1 x square y square again we will get the same answer therefore you can write this in two ways also 1 upon x y whole square or 1 upon x square y square here is the next question x to the power 6 x to the power minus 3 x to the power 2 i am writing them together x to 6 x to the power 6 into x to the power minus 3 into x to the power 2 into y to the power 4 into y to the power minus 5 into z to the power minus 2 into z to the power 4 into z to the power minus 1 i'll use the law of exponent 6 minus 3 plus 2 into y to the power 4 minus 5 minus 2 that is z to the power minus 2 minus 1 plus 4 x to the power 6 minus 3 3 3 plus 2 5 y to the power 4 minus 5 is minus 1 into z to the power minus 2 minus 1 minus 3 4 minus 3 is 1 therefore the answer is x to the power 5 into z i'll bring that y downside it becomes x to the power 5 into z divided by y this is the required answer simplify x to the power 12 divided by x to the power 7 x to the power 12 when x to the power 7 goes to the top that is numerator it becomes minus it can be written as x to the power 12 minus 7 12 minus 7 is 5 x to the power 5 is the answer here i'll take z to the power minus 3 to the top that is to the numerator z to the power 6 into z to the power 3 now i can add 6 plus 3 z to the power 9 is the required answer in this question i'll take each term to the numerator m to the power 5 into m to the power cube is equal to m to the power minus 2 m to the power plus 4 they change their sign when they go to the numerator 
m to the power 5 minus that is minus 2 into n to the power 3 into n to the power 4. I am rearranging the terms. m to the power 5 minus 3 into m to the power 3 plus 4. m to the power 5 minus 2 is 3 into n to the power 3 plus 4 is 7. This is the required answer. Here we go with the next question. Simplify. 18x to the power 9 divided by 6x to the power 7. 6 1s are 6 3s are 18. X to the power 7, I will take it to the numerator. 3x to the power 9 into x to the power minus 7. x to the power 9 minus 7. It becomes 3 into 9 minus 7 is 2. 3x square is the answer for this question. 7 a to the power 12 divided by 56 a to the power 5. 7 1s are 7, 7 8s are 56. 1 upon 8 into I'll take 8 to the power 15 to the top. 12 into a to the power minus 15. 1 upon 8 a to the power 12 minus 15 1 upon 8 a to the power 12 minus 15 is minus 3 I will bring that minus 3 downside it becomes 1 upon 8 into 1 upon a cube we know that 8 a cube this one that is 1 upon 8 a cube is the required answer. We can also rewrite like this. 2 can be written as 2 cube. That is 2 into 2 into 3 is 8. 2 times when multiplied 3 it becomes 2 cube. That is 8. 1 upon 2 a cube. Bracket cube is the answer. Simplify this. a to the power 13 b to the power 7 whole divided by a to the power 5 b to the power minus 3 I'll take denominator to the numerator a to the power 13 b to the power 7 into a to the power minus 5 b to the power plus 3 they, there will be a change in sign a to the power 13 minus 5 b to the power 7 plus 3 I have to take the same basis a to the power 13 minus 5 is 8 into b to the power 10 this is the answer we need this is the final answer a to the power 8 into b to the power 10 7 x to the power 14 whole divided by 21 x to the power minus 10 7 1 is 7 7 3 is 21 1 upon 3 into x to the power 14 into x to the power minus 10 when it comes to the numerator it becomes 10 1 upon 3 x to the power 14 plus 10 1 upon 3 x to the power 14 plus 10 is 24 this is the required answer here here we go with the next question p to the power 11 divided by p to the power 11 p to the power 11 divided by p to the power 11 i'll take p to the power 11 to the top numerator p to the power minus 11 p to the power 11 minus 11 what is that p to the power 0 we know that anything raised to the power 0 is 1 we can also cancel here directly p to the power 11 divided by p to the power 11 1 we will get the answer also here we go with the next one i will take it to the numerator a to the power 7 into when it comes to the top it becomes a to the power plus 2 b to the power 5 when this b to the power b cube when it comes to the top it becomes b to the power minus 3 c to the power 4 when this c to the power 6 comes to the top it becomes t to c to the power minus 6 a to the power 7 plus 2 9 b to the power 5 minus 3 is 2 c to the power 4 minus 6 a to the power 9 b to the power 2 b square c to the power minus 2 a to the power 9 b square i will bring this c to the power minus 2 to the down c square this is the answer 
simplify a to the power 3 raise to the power 2 it can be I can use this law of exponent a to the power m to the power n is equal to a to the power m into n similarly I'm by using that law of exponent I can write this 3 into 2 that is a to the power 6 that is the answer 2 to the power 4 into x to the power 2 into 4 into y to the power 1 into 4 if nothing is there 1 1 into 4 2 to the power 4 that is the 16 x to the power 8 y to the power 4 so this is the way to solve the problem by using the law of exponent e to the power m to the power n is equal to e to the power m into n. I am using the same law of exponent here m to the power 2 into 4 into n to the power minus 3 into 4. m to the power 2 into 4 is 8 into n to the power minus 3 into 4 is minus 12 i'll bring this n to the power minus 12 downside that is to the denominator n to the power 12 this is the answer here x to the power 2 into minus 2 into y to the power minus 3 into minus 2 x to the power 2 into minus 2 is minus 4 y to the power minus into minus plus 3 into 2 6 I will take this x to the power minus 4 downside x to the power 4 this is how we have to solve this question simplify x square y to the power minus 3 raised to the power minus 2 x to the power 2 into 2 into y to the power minus 3 into minus 2 here x to the power 2 into minus 2 is minus 4 and y into minus into minus plus 3 into 2 is 6 i'll take this x to the power minus 4 to the denominator it becomes x to the power 4 when i bring it to the denominator it changes its sign 3 to the power 1 into 2 x to the power 3 into 2 into y to the power minus 3 into 2 3 square into x to the power 6 into y to the power minus 6 3 square means 9 into x to the power 6 I'll bring this y to the power minus 6 downside it becomes y to the power 6 this one 5 to the power 1 into 3 m to the power 4 into 3 n to the power minus 3 into 3 phi to the power 3 into m to the power 12 into n to the power minus 9 125 into m to the power 12 n to the power minus 9 is equal to this is the answer 125 m to the power 12 n to the power 9 I am using this same law of exponent e to the power m to the power n is equal to e to the power m into n evaluate 36 to the power 1 by 2 I will write 36 as 6 into 6 6 into 1 36 is equal to 6 square this 36 to the power 1 by 2 he had given here how you write this 36 6 square rise to the power 1 by 2 e to the power m to the power n is equal to e to the power m into n this 6 to the power 2 into 1 by 2 2 to get cancels here 6 to the power 1 and 6 to the power 1 is 6 coming to this question 27 to the power 2 by 3 27 can be written as 3 9s are 3 3s are 3 1s are 27 is equal to 3 cube 27 i'll write as 3 cube to the power 2 by 3 i will write 3 into 2 by 3 
I am using this law of exponent a to the power m n is equal to a to the power m into n. 3 3 get cancels here x to the power 2. x square is the answer. How I can write x in place of x I will write 3. 3 square is 9. Here we go with the next question. 16. This 16 can be written as 2 to 8 2 4 the 2 4 the 2 2 the. This 16 is equal to 2 to the power 4. I'll substitute this value in the given question. 16 that is to the power minus 3 by 4. 16 can be written as 2 to the power 4 rise to the power minus 3 by 4. 2 to the power 4 into minus 3 by 4. 4 4 get cancels here. 2 to the power minus 3. I'll bring it down. 2 to the power 3. 1 upon 8. That is the given required answer. Similarly, 64. I'll factorize it by 4 1s 4 6 are 24. 4 4s 4 1s what I do here 64 is equal to 4 cube 64 that is 4 cube rise to the power minus 1 by 3 4 3 into minus 1 by 3 3 3 get cancels here 4 to the power minus 1 is equal to 1 upon 4 this is the answer Here we go with the next question. Evaluate 81 to the power minus 1 by 4. We know that 81 can be written as 3, 2, 3, 7, 3, 9, 3, prime factorize it. 3, 9, 3, 3, 3, 3, 1, 3. Therefore, 81 is equal to 3 to the power 1, 2, 3, 4, 3 to the power 4. I'll substitute this value in the given equation. 81 to the power minus 1 by 4 is equal to 3 to the power 4 rise to the power minus 1 by 4 3 to the power 4 into minus 1 by 4 4 4 get cancels 3 to the power minus 1 I'll bring it down 1 to the power 3 1 upon 3 this is the given answer required answer 32 can also be written as 2 1s are 2 6s are 12 2 8s are 2 4s are 2 2s are 2 1s are 32 and 2 3 4 5 32 is equal to 2 to the power 5 therefore in place of 32 I'll write 2 to the power 5 raised to the power minus 4 by 5 2 to the power 5 into minus 4 by 5 5 5 get cancels here 2 to the power minus 4 which is equal to 1 upon 2 to the power 4 1 upon 2 to the power 4 is equal to 16. We know that 2, 2, 2, 2, 4 multiplied and it becomes 16. This is the required answer. Simplify 25a square raised to the power 1 by 2. 25 can be written as 5 square. I will write this as 5 square a square raised to the power 1 by 2 that is plus 1 by 2 I'll write here 5 to the power 2 into 1 by 2 into 8 to the power 2 into 1 by 2 2 2 get cancels 2 2 get cancels okay. here 5 into a that is 5 a is the answer for this question in this question 27 can be written as 3 cube 3 cube x to the power minus 3 rise to the power 1 by 3. 3 to the power 3 into 1 by 3 into x to the power minus 3 into 1 by 3. 3 3 get cancels 3 3 get cancels 3 to the power 1 into 3 x to the power minus 1. 3 to the power 1 divided by x. See we can bring that minus to the downside that is to the numerator. 64 m to the power minus 6 n cube raised to the power 2 by 3. 64 can be written as 4 cube. Why I am writing 4 cube? Because there in the power 2 by 3 is there. 
we know that 64 can be written as 232 216 to 8 the 2 4 the 2 2 the 2 1 the 1 2 3 4 5 6 2 to the power 6 it can be written as that is divisible by 3 also we can take either 4 to the power 3 or 2 to the power 6 anything i can take now 4 cube m to the power minus 6 into n cube raised to the power 2 by 3 4 to the power 3 into 2 by 3 into m to the power minus 6 into 2 by 3 into n cube raised to the power 2 by 3 3 3 get cancels 3 1 the 3 2 the 3 3 get cancels 4 square that into m to the power minus 2 minus 4 into n square i will bring this n m to the power minus 4 to the downside that is to the denominator m to the power 4 this is the required answer here we go with the next question we know that 81 can also be written as 3 to the power 4 3 to the power 4 means multiplying 3 by 4 times we will get what 81 that is 327 are 3 9s are 3 3s are 3 1s are 3 to the power 4 is equal to 81 so this can be written as 3 to the power 4 into a to the power 4 into b to the power 8 into c to the power minus 4 raised to the power 1 by 4 3 to the power 4 into 1 by 4 a to the power 4 into 1 by 4 b to the power 8 into 1 by 4 c to the power minus 4 into 1 by 4 4 4 get cancels 4 4 get cancels 4 and the 4 to the 4 minus 3 to the power 1 into a b square c to the power minus 1 3 a b square divided by c when it comes to the denominator it changes the sign c 3 a b square by c this is the answer here we go with the next question. Simplify 3x to the power minus 3y cube raised to the power minus 2. 3 to the power minus 2 x to the power minus 3 into minus 2 y to the power 3 into minus 2. 3 to the power minus 2 that is 3 to the power minus 2 into 3 to the power minus 3 into minus 2 that is plus 6. Y to the power 3 into minus 2 is minus 6. So I'll bring this minus to the denominator 3 square into y to the power 6 x to the power 6 3 square is 9 we know that y to the power 6 we can also write this as x 6 to 6 into a b square c to the power minus 3 raised to the power 1 minus 1 6 to the power minus 1 a to the power minus 1 b to the power 2 into minus 1 c to the power minus 3 into 1 6 to the power minus 1 into a to the power minus 1 b to the power minus 2 into c to the power plus 3 i'll place c cube in the numerator and rest everything i'll bring it down 6 a b square c cube divided by 6 a b square is the answer for this question Simplify minus 3 a to the power 3 by 4 b raised to the power minus 1 by 4 bracket 4 minus 3 to the power 4 into a b to the power minus 1 by 4 into 4 minus 3 to the power 4 that is minus to the power 4 it becomes plus 3 to the power 4 is 81 4 4 get cancels 4 4 get cancels a cube b to the power minus 1 81 a cube i'll bring b downside 81 a cube divided by 3 b 32 can be written as 2 16 are 2 8 are 2 4 are 2 2 are 2 1 za. 32 is equal to 2 to the power 5 this 2 to the power 5 32 can be written as 2 to the power 5 a to the power 10 b to the power minus 5 raised to the power 1 by 5 2 to the power 5 into 1 by 5 a to the power 10 into 1 by 5 b to the power minus 5 into 1 by 5 5 5 get cancels 5 1 the 5 2 the 5 1 the 5 1 the 2 to the power 1 into a square into b to the power minus 1 2 a square divided by b this is the answer 
when that minus comes to the denominator it becomes plus it changes the sign simplify cube root of 18 y to the power minus 12 z cube if i remove this cube root it takes the power of 1 by 3 x to the power 18 raised to the power 1 by 3 into y to the power minus 12 into 1 by 3 z cube raised to the power 1 by 3 3 1s are 3 6s are 3 1s are 3 4s are 3 3 get cancelled so x to the power 6 into y to the power minus 4 into z x to the power 6 into z divided by y to the power 4 this is the required answer for this question here we go with the next question x to the power m plus n into x to the power n plus 2 into n plus l into x to the power l plus m i'll take the lhs we have to show that lhs is equal to rhs i'll take lhs a to the power m n for this i am using the identity a to the power m into a to the power n is equal to a to the power m plus n here x to the power m plus n plus n plus l plus n plus m i have to add all the powers here in the denominator also what i do i'll take the help of this law of exponent that is a to the power m into n is equal to a to the power mn 2m 2 into m 2m into x to the power 2n into x to the power 2l m plus m 2m n plus n 2n l plus l to l similarly here in the denominator also i'll make use of this first law of exponent that is x to the power 2m plus 2n plus 2l see here both numerator and denominator both are same i can cancel both numerator and denominator and i'll get the answer 1 which is equal to rhs hence lhs is equal to rhs it is proved Thank you. Here we go with the next question. Show that square root of x to the power p minus q into square root of q minus r into square root of r minus p is equal to 1. I will take the left hand side. When I remove the square, it takes the power 1 by 2. Similarly, x to the power q minus r, it takes the power 1 by 2 into x to the power r minus p, it takes the power 1 by 2 this is the LHS left hand side and I x to the power p minus q into 1 by 2 that is p minus q by 2 into x to the power q minus r divided by 2 into x to the power r minus p by 2 I will add all these <coughs> powers a to the power m into n is equal to a to the power m plus n. Yeah. A to the power p minus q by 2 plus q minus r by 2 in plus r minus p by 2 which is equal to x to the power the LCM is a 2 p minus q p minus q plus q minus r plus r minus p q p minus p plus q minus q plus r minus r it cancels p to the power x to the power 0 by 2 which is equal to x to the power 0 we know that anything to the power 0 is equal to 1 which is equal to rhs hence lhs is equal to rhs it is proved here we go with the next question show that this left hand side is equal to uh, 1 that is x to the power p r divided by x to the power q r into x to the power q into p is p q similarly x to the power p r r p that is p r into x to the power r q r q r divided by x to the power p r see here you can cancel here x to the power p r x to the power pr x to the power qr x to the power qr x to the power pq and x to the power pq all are cancelled here and therefore 
the answer is 1 which is equal to RHS LHS is equal to RHS hence it is proof. here we go with the next one again here he is asking to prove LHS is equal to 1 x to the power a into a minus b I'll take this minus b to the top it becomes x to the power a into x to the power b is equal to into a to the power minus b here x to the power b into x to the power c I am taking denominators to the numerator x to the power c I'll take it to the numerator x to the power a it changes the sign when I take it to the numerator that is b minus c what I do here x to the power a into b is equal to x to the power a plus b raised to the power a minus b x to the power b plus c into x to the power b minus c x to the power c plus a into c minus a x to the power a plus b into a minus b x to the power b plus c into b minus c x to the power c plus a into c minus a x to the power we know that a plus b into a minus b is equal to a square minus b square x to the power b plus c into b minus c is b square minus c square x to the power c plus a into c minus a c square minus a square i'll combine these terms a square minus b square plus b square minus c square in plus c square minus a square a square minus a square plus b square minus b square plus c square minus c square x to the power 0 which is equal to 1 which is equal to RHS hence it is proved here again he is asking you to prove LHS is also 1 x to the power a plus b into a minus b divided by x to the power c into a minus b multiplied by x to the power b plus c into b minus c divided by x to the power a into b minus c multiplied by x to the power c plus a multiplied by c minus a divided by x to the power b into c minus a a plus b into a minus b is equal to a square minus b square divided by x to the power c a minus c b multiplied by x to the power b square minus c square divided by x to the power a b minus b a c multiplied by x to the power c square minus a square divided by x to the power b c minus c a this can be written as x to the power a square a to the power m into a to the power n is equal to a to the power m plus n i want to use this law of exponent to solve this a square minus b square plus b square minus c square plus c square minus a square divided by x to the power c a minus c b plus a b minus a c plus b c minus c a plus c a minus c a b c b c a b a b a c plus a square minus a square here I am going to cancel <coughs> plus c square minus c square plus b square minus b square plus c square minus c square here x to the power 0 nothing is there and x to the power 0 in the denominator x to the power 0 is 1 x to the power 0 is 1 which is equal to 1 which is equal to right hand side Hence it is proved. Again he is asking in this question to prove left hand side is equal to 1. I am taking this denominator to the numerator x to the power a square into x to the power minus b square raised to the power 1 upon a plus b into 
x to the power b square into x to the power minus c square raised to the power 1 upon b plus c multiplied by x to the power c square into x to the power minus a square raised to the power 1 upon c plus a. This can be written as x to the power a square minus b square raised to the power 1 upon a plus b into x to the power b square minus c square raised to the power 1 upon b plus c multiplied by x to the power c square minus a square raised to the power 1 upon c plus a x to the power a square minus b square can be written as a plus b divided by a plus b into similarly x to the power b square minus c square divided by b plus c multiplied by x to the power c square minus a square divided by c plus a x to the power a square minus b square can be written as a plus b into a minus b divided by a plus b into x to the power b square minus c square is written as b plus c into b minus c divided by b plus c into x to the power c square minus a square can be written as c plus a into c minus a divided by c plus a a plus b a plus b b plus c b plus a c plus a c plus a get cancels here what remains here let me write here I'm rubbing this what remains there I'm rubbing and writing here now here x to the power a minus b that is the remaining term into x to the power b minus c into x to the power c minus a now i am going to add all the powers a minus b plus b minus c plus c minus a plus a minus a plus b minus b plus c minus c x to the power 0 is equal to 1 which is equal to right hand side here we go with the next question before that I want to write some identities a plus b cube can be written as a cube plus b cube plus 3 a b into a plus b a cube plus b cube I'll keep it on the right hand side and rest remaining terms I'll take it to the left hand side minus 3 a b a plus b which is equal to a q plus b q now I'll take a q plus b q is equal to a plus b cube minus 3 a b into a plus b this a plus b bracket cube can be written as a plus b into a plus b bracket square because it again becomes a plus b bracket cube only minus 3 a b into a plus b i take a plus b as common here and i'll write the remaining terms a plus b bracket square minus 3 a b a plus b a plus b bracket square is equal to a square plus b square plus 2ab minus 3ab a plus b a square plus b square in the 3ab and 2ab that is minus ab therefore a cube plus b cube is equal to a plus b into a square plus b square minus ab this identity we must remember to solve the numericals which is very 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 important to solve the next numericals similarly 
I am going to explain about one more important identity that is a minus b bracket cube which is having its expansion as a cube plus b cube minus 3 a b into the bracket a minus b. Sorry it is a cube minus b cube. This is the identity. I will keep the a cube minus b cube on one side and rest I will take it to the left hand side. Again I am rewriting here. To be specific, a minus b bracket cube is equal to a cube minus b cube minus 3 a b into the bracket a minus b. I will keep a cube minus b cube and rest everything I will take it to the left hand side. a minus b bracket cube is equal to 3 a b into the bracket a minus b is equal to a cube minus b cube. Here, a minus b, I will take it common. And here what remains here? A minus b bracket square in the first term. And in the second term, 3ab which is equal to a cube minus b cube. A minus b is equal to a minus b bracket square can be written as a square plus b square minus 2ab plus 3ab. Which is equal to a cube minus b cube a minus b bracket a square plus b square in 3ab minus 2ab if we subtract we will get ab which is equal to a cube minus b cube. This is the one more important identity we should remember in algebra. And these are the identity you should remember. a cube minus b cube is equal to a minus b into the bracket a square plus b square plus a b. And a cube plus b cube is equal to a plus b into the bracket a square plus b square minus a b. These are the most two important identities we should remember in solving the numericals. Next one, he is asking to prove LHS is equal to 1. I am taking the left hand side. For this, I am taking all the denominators to the numerator. x to the power a into x to the power minus b. Rest to the power a square plus a b plus b square. Multiplied by x to the power b into x to the power minus c. Rest to the power b square plus b c plus c square multiplied by x to the power c into x to the power minus a raised to the power c square plus c a plus a square. This can be written as x to the power a minus b raised to the power into a square plus a b plus b square multiplied by x to the power b minus c multiplied by b square plus bc plus c square multiplied by x to the power c minus a multiplied by c square minus c a plus a square just now we saw this formula a cube minus b cube is equal to a minus b into the bracket a square plus a b plus b square. I am using the same identity here to solve this numerical. x to the power it is looking like a cube minus b cube expansion and it is looking like b cube minus c cube expansion and it third term is looking like c cube minus a cube expansion. Here a cube minus b cube plus b cube minus c cube plus c cube minus a cube plus a cube minus a cube plus b cube minus b cube plus c cube minus c cube which is equal to x to the power 0 which is equal to 1 which is equal to RHS. Hence it is proved. Here is an expression. Proved. Find out the value of this. x to the power a into 1 by a b whole divided by x to the power b into 1 by a b multiplied by x to the power b into 1 by bc x to the power c into 1 by bc multiplied by x to the power c into 1 by a divided by x to the power a into 1 by ca 
A A get cancels B B get cancels B B get cancels C C get cancels C C get cancels A A get cancels. Here what remains x to the power one by B x to the power one by A into x to the power one by C x to the power one by B multiplied by x to the power one by A x to the power one by C. I can cancel 1 by B, 1 by B, 1 by A, 1 by A, 1 by C, 1 by C, which is equal to 1. This is the answer. Here we go with the next question. Evaluate. I am rearranging this. X to the power A minus B can be written as X to the power A into X to the power minus B and this can be written as X to the power B into X to the power minus A. What I do here, 1 plus X to the power A, I will bring it to the denominator X to the power B plus 1 upon X to the power B to the X to the power A. I will take the LCM here, X to the power B plus x to the power a and this denominator goes to the numerator here x to the power b here similarly x to the power a it comes to the numerator and this is the lcm for this second term here the whole denominator is x to the power a plus x to the power b x to the power a divided by x to the power a plus x to the power b here LCM is x to the power A plus x to the power B. Similarly, in the numerator also x to the power B plus x to the power A. x to the power B plus x to the power A. This one, this term, both numerator and denominator are same. Hence, the value is 1. Simplify this. A B to the power Y into A B to the power minus Z, B C to the power Z, B C to the power minus X, C A to the power X, C A to the power Y minus Y. I will take the whole terms here B C C A C A. A b to the power y divided by a b to the power z into b c to the power z b c to the power z minus x c a to the power x c a to the power y i will expand it further a to the power y into b to the power y a to the power z into b to the power z b to the power z into c to the power z b to the power x into c to the power x c to the power x into a to the power x c to the power y into a to the power y a to the power y a to the power y b to the power z b to the power z c to the power x c to the power x what are the remaining terms here in the numerator a to the power x b to the power y c to the power z divided by a to the power z b to the power x c to the power y this is the final answer let's see any further simplification is possible. Here, a to the power x into a to the power minus z, a b to the power y into minus x c to the power z minus y. This can be the simplified answer. Simplify this term x to the power 2n plus 3 plus 2n plus 1 multiplied by n plus 2 divided by 
x to the power 2n plus 1 that is multiplied by plus n into 2n plus 1 x to the power 2n plus 3 plus 2n into n 2n square plus 2n into 2 4n plus 1 into n is n plus 2 divided by x to the power 2 into 3 that is 6n plus 3 plus 2n square plus n x to the power 2n plus 4n plus n 7n 2n square plus 7n 3 plus 2 5 whole divided by x to the power 2n square plus 7n plus 3 I'll take this denominator to the numerator x to the power 2n square plus 7n plus 5u minus when it goes to the numerator all terms becomes minus 2n square minus 7n minus 3 now I can add these powers x to the power 2n square plus 7n plus 5u minus 2n square minus 7n minus 3 2n square minus 2n square 7n minus 7 5 minus 3 is x square this is the answer x square <coughs> simplify this term e to the power 7 plus 2n into e to the power 2 into 3 n plus 2 whole divided by e to the power 4 into 2n plus 3 which is equal to e to the power 7 plus 2n into e to the power 2 into 3n is 6n plus 2 into 2 is 4 divided by e to the power 4 into 2 is 8n plus 4 into 3 is 12. I am adding this power so 2n plus 6n plus 4 into I will take it to the numerator e to the power 8n that is minus 8n minus 12 now I can add the powers e to the power 7 plus 2n plus 6n plus 4 minus 8n minus 12 e to the power 7 2n plus 6n 8n minus 8n 7 plus 4 11 11 minus 12 e to the power 11 minus 12 a to the power minus 1 which is equal to 1 by a this is answer